Hello, my name is Justin Odisho, and in this Adobe After Effects tutorial, I'm going to show you how to render or export your videos. So let's say you're working on a composition and you've got a project to your satisfaction, whatever you're working on. You see right here, it says Comp 1, and you can see the information about this composition, all the layers. And if you go to Composition, Add to Render Queue, this will open up your Render Queue tab and it will add that composition. So we have a couple settings here. We can choose the render settings. And if you click on it, you can choose quality resolution. I'll just leave it all default. You can also see here the start and end time. This is a 30 second composition that I created. So that's why it's gonna be 30 seconds when I, when I render it. But you can always make it start and end at whatever time you want and press okay. And then the output module is kind of like the format that you choose. So by default, it's going to be QuickTime, but you can choose a variation of different things, especially if you're just exporting for MP3 or some other reason. You can also choose to resize in this menu if you wanted it to be smaller or larger than your original. I'm just using a standard 1920 by 1080 HD ratio, but you can input your own. Again, you don't have to change any of these. I'm just showing you what they do. And most importantly, you have the output too. So this is where it's going to render and save your file. I'm just going to send it to my desktop and you can name it whatever you want. And once you have all the settings how you want or, or leave them how, however you like, you can press render and you'll see this blue bar start to fill up and it'll render your video and your entire composition. And once it's done, it'll play a nice little chime sound effect to let you know that your render is finished. So once you do hear that chime noise, you should be able to find your final composition on your desktop. And you can always tab back over your composition if you want to keep working. Another thing that you can do and if you want some more options is when you add it to your render queue, here's just a list that was the last thing we rendered. This is a new thing that we're rendering. You can always queue it in Adobe Media Encoder and this will actually send your composition to Adobe Media Encoder, which is a separate encoding program in the Creative Cloud Suite. And that'll give you a couple more options, especially if you want to do like H.264 or other file types that aren't always in every version of After Effects now. So in Media Coder is very similar. You have some options that you can choose from and where to output it to. And you simply press play and it will queue and render it this way. So that's a very basic introduction to get your projects rendered and exported in Adobe After Effects. If you enjoyed this tutorial, you can check out dozens of other After Effects tutorials in the playlist on my channel and subscribe to stay tuned for all of my new videos. My name is Justin Odisho. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.